Welcome to the Huawei SMP7 launch event and uh, welcome to be one of the first persons uh, on the globe to see the new Huawei SMP7. This is designed to be beautiful, outstanding. So, in heritage of the SNP1 and the SNP6, which we launched last year with major success, we continued our double C design philosophy. So you can see one C shape here, and you will see the other C shape here, making this phone uh, uh, the same as, as their predecessors in terms of design DNA. But of course, we brought some new innovative uh, finishing touches to the phone to make it outstanding in the industry. What I mean is we have um, glass on the back side, not only on the front, so you have Gorilla Glass latest version on the front, you also have Gorilla Glass latest version on the back, and we do have, uh, I hope you can see that, we do have a micro texture below the glass, which is actually uh, um, existing out of seven single layers, uh, very, very small layers, to make that metallic look, to make all these beautiful shimmering colors in that phone. In terms of hardware, you're looking at a 5-inch Full HD display with a, D a PPI higher than 440 and you're also looking at the uh, world's first 8 megapixel front-facing selfie camera that comes together with a panoramic selfie feature. On the back side, we have the 13 megapixel camera which is using the latest Sony uh, sensor latest generation high quality sensor to make perfect pictures of course finished up with Huawei's own uh, picture engine smart engine 2. So um, talking about the camera you will see that we have uh, outstanding performance on the selfies we have uh, 8 megapixel and we have the uh, panoramic feature for selfies so you can get more details and more background and young yourself not just you in the picture, but it's also uh, the things that surround you and actually the places where you are, which is sometimes more important than actually just showing yourself off. On the back side, you see uh, our 13 megapixel shooter, which is not just perfect for um, great pictures, but it's actually perfect for the small things in life. So you can go very, very close with that phone and you can uh, do a lot of macro pictures with this. Like I said before, we have the Smart Engine version number two, which is there to actually take all the pain from you in terms of settings and what settings are correct in order for me to, to make the best picture out of that. So you can go to normal, you can go to HDR, you can go to panorama and all these other things, but the Smart Engine is really designed for you to support and get always the best shot. Um, Sometimes the best shot doesn't necessarily mean that you have lots of time. The best shot is simultaneous and uh, spontaneous. So uh, we designed a feature that you can actually double press the volume key and it will take immediately a picture. And this time it took 1.2 seconds. So the phone doesn't need to be on, it can be in standby. You just press the, double, the volume double time and then you take a picture straight ahead. Besides our outstanding camera performance, um, we do have a quad core chipset, 1.8 gigahertz, the latest generation from High Silicon. It's the Kirin 910T. We have two gigabytes of RAM, 16 gigabyte of ROM, and we support micro SD on top of that. In terms of software, what you see is Android in its latest version, Android 4.4 KitKat, together with Huawei's Emotion Y 2.3, which is another um, premiere for this phone. It's the first phone to launch with Android and uh, Emotion Y 2.3. Emotion UI 2.3 brings you uh, lots of new designs. We will have online themes, uh, up to 100 online themes to support you and to bring the unique look that you share with that phone. Um, can you mention when it's due out? Um, when it's due to arrive? To yeah. The S&P 7 will arrive uh, early June and the recommended retail price is 449 euros. That's 449. Uh, thank you very much.